Conditions Now, WOAY forecaster Braden Petrie with your full seven-day forecast. And a happy Saturday. It's been a beautiful day out there today. Plenty of sunshine and those temperatures above average out there once again for the afternoon. Should be at 81 degrees for this time of the year. Checked in at 85 degrees out of the Beckley area. So a few degrees above average out there for this evening. Current temperatures sitting in those upper 70s, highest elevations. The rest of the area seeing those temperatures in the 80s. 79 in Marlinton, 81 degrees in Summersville, 80 degrees currently in Oak Hill, 80 degrees as well in Beckley, 82 in Pineville, 79 currently as you go down into Bluefield. Taking a look at those temperatures over the next several days, we should be in the low 80s for this time of the year. That cold front pushes through tomorrow, dropping those temperatures below average as we go Sunday into Monday. We're talking upper 70s for the daytime highs as we go over the next couple of days. And as we take a look towards the next week, those temperatures warming slightly above average Tuesday through Thursday. We're talking low to mid 80s in the forecast as you go towards the middle part of next week. The good news is we are staying mostly dry for now, seeing mostly sunny conditions across southern West Virginia. But as we look to the east of us, seeing some active weather across the Carolinas. As you look to the west of us as well, seeing some active weather taking shape across Kentucky down into the southeast. Good news is though we are staying mostly dry this evening before the showers from Kentucky into the southeast eventually push your way into our region as we go towards early tomorrow morning. And those showers could stick with us off and on throughout the day tomorrow. We can see that on the planner for the next 12 hours, staying mostly cloudy out there this evening, keeping those temperatures relatively warm at the surface. We're talking upper 60s to low 70s for the nighttime lows tonight. Then tracking a few scattered showers and storms in the forecast as we go throughout the day tomorrow. Those temperatures quickly dropping into the upper 60s as we head towards your afternoon. Those changes of precipitation over the next seven days just have to get through tomorrow first. We're seeing a, a lot of rain in the forecast as we go Sunday into Sunday evening. But once we get past that, expecting a beautiful Monday, Tuesday into Wednesday, cooler temperatures and plenty of sunshine before seeing a couple scattered showers possibly come back to the forecast as we go towards later next week. So timing this out on future cast, expecting a mostly dry evening and overnight ahead. Those showers eventually push into our region as we head into early tomorrow morning. We may get a break as we head into early afternoon before tracking a few more gusty showers and storms possible in the forecast as we close out tomorrow. Before we do see a beautiful Monday ahead, those temperatures cooling down and plenty of sunshine in the forecast. The severe weather outlook as we go into tomorrow, seeing a marginal risk across the entire region. Have to go just to the east to reduce that level two threat. But overall, not expecting much in the way of severe weather tomorrow. Could see some downpours, maybe some gusty winds. But overall, the highest threat stays just to the east of us as you go into your day tomorrow. Taking a look at the seven day forecast out there, could see some showers and storms in the forecast throughout the day on Sunday. Expecting a cooler day as we go into Monday. Temperatures staying cooler in the upper 70s to low 80s by Tuesday. Expecting another beautiful day Wednesday, possibly even into Thursday. Before seeing some more active weather come back to the forecast as we go towards about a week from now, Kayvon. Yeah, Brandon, so tomorrow we've been talking about this all week. Tomorrow's going to get some showers. Yeah, often on scattered showers and storms throughout the day. Then we're turning much cooler with temperatures in the 70s and with mostly sunny conditions by Monday. Yeah, it's interesting. It's been like a 80, 80, 70, 70, 80, and then you see after uh, to Monday, it goes back to 80s the rest of the week. Yep. So if you're a fan of cooler weather, enjoy Monday into Tuesday because we get those warmer temperatures right back to the forecast for the middle of next week. Yeah, I'll 